<laughs> Hello everybody to HD edition on the single player with Age of Kings campaign with the last campaign of William Wallace the Battle of Falkirk. So let's see how it goes. The only way we can hold the boggy lowlands around Falkirk is to build a castle and as many walls as we can construct in a short time. These fortifications will serve to protect our camp as we construct siege weapons with which to assault the English castle. Once the castle is constructed, Wallace himself has sworn to join our forces and together we will attack Longshanks and his English troops. The English could attack at any time. You have some walls already, but you should complete them as soon as you have enough stone. If you have surplus resources of one type, you can sell them for gold at your market. You can then use the gold to buy what you need. You can also build towers to defend your city. Units can garrison within a tower for defense and protection, and archers can even fire out of a tower. To build a castle, you must first advance to the next Bid age, fear. the castle age. Oh, bid fear. The advanced buttons let you set combat states for your soldiers. A defensive soldier will be less likely to attack an enemy that comes near him. Click a military unit, then note the combat stance buttons on the lower left corner of the screen. Congratulations. You're going to find lots of things to do in the castle age. For starters, try building a siege workshop to make battering rams and other siege weapons. Using the advanced buttons, you can also order a soldier to patrol an area between two points and guard or follow another unit. Bid fear, Bid fear, Kia Rob Wigan. The advanced buttons allow access to a new type of formation. For example, with a box formation, you can protect a weak unit such as a monk. You may need to assign extra villagers to gather stone so you'll have enough to build the castle and all the fortifications you'll need. Bro, 
Здорово, боги. Great! You've completed the castle. Sir William should be here soon, and then it will be time to attack the English. Wallace has come. One of your most powerful units is created at the castle. Create ten more Wode Raiders. Our love. Rabuga. 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 To. Bid fear. Bid fear. Kia. Rabuga. Rabuga. Kia. Bargara. John. With your new siege workshop, you can make batter in rams. Rams are slow, but they're resistant to arrow fire and excellent at knocking down walls. You may need some rams to attack the English castle. William Wallace and his wood raiders on your side, the English may be in trouble. Once you have a large army with plenty of siege weapons, go. Destroy the English castle. Trebuchets are massive siege weapons with a great range, available only in the Imperial Age. Remember that trebuchets must be packed to move and unpacked to fire. Kid? Cut. Four pair. Toe. 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 Bid fear. Toe. Done cut. Four pair. Toe. Bid fear. Bid fear. Toe. Bid fear. Toe. Done cut. Oh, 
Castle at Falkirk is no more. The English pretensions in Scotland are surely at an end. The forces of Wallace are triumphant. It looked certain that we would be defeated at Falkirk. Yet, somehow, though outnumbered and outranged by English longbows, we were victorious! English castle was torn down, and a Scottish one will be built in its place. William Wallace has shown us the path to victory. Although he's but one man, he inspires great deeds in others, and many of the Scottish princes and lords have drawn their swords with his. Wallace's own sword is a five and a half foot beast, forged, of course, in Scotland. He has sworn not to rest until his sword finds the neck of Edward Longshanks. The struggle will continue, but we have learned the ways of war. Now, it is the English who will know fear. Well, that was the last campaign of William Wallace. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a like button, subscribe to my channel, and also write down in the comments below what I should play next. Or if you wish to play with me, I'll write down my Steam name and my Skype name so we could play and enjoy things together. So I'll be uploading the new other campaign with Jean of Arc on the un Unlikely Messiah soon as quickly as possible so i see you guys later have a good one